Finally, it's happening. The Shiba Inu team delivers their promises, literally crushing all the haters. This new development will attract a ton of new people to Shiba Inu project like crazy. Make sure to watch this video until the very end. You cannot afford to miss this one. Disclaimer. The second burn out of three has just occurred. We are now one step closer to the massive Shibarium upgrade that will change the whole game for Shiba Inu coin. The tweet by Lucy, the Shiba Inu's team member, shares news about the second burn event for Shiba Inu cryptocurrency. It implies that a third burn event is on the horizon. The use of emojis, such as fire and hearts, adds a touch of excitement, visually expressing enthusiasm for the Shiba burn. Notably, the tweet discloses that a substantial amount, specifically 8.6 billion Shiba Inu tokens, was burned during this event, translating to a value of almost 90,000 in USD. The burning process involves intentionally removing tokens from circulation, a strategy often used to enhance the value and scarcity of the remaining tokens. Now, why is this such big news? Let me explain. If you remember, Shibarium is rolling out a groundbreaking token burning mechanism, essential for the network's economic model. The primary goal of this mechanism is to strategically reduce the token supply, potentially amplifying the token's value and fostering benefits for its broader ecosystem. You know the one cent dream that is a huge discussion among the Shiba community? The one cent dream for Shiba Inu refers to the aspiration among investors and supporters of the Shiba Inu cryptocurrency that its value per token will reach one penny in the future. The challenge with achieving the one cent mark is attributed to the massive supply of Shiba Inu tokens. A large token supply can make it difficult for the price per token to reach higher values as the market capitalization would have to increase significantly. To put it simply, for a cryptocurrency to reach a certain price level, the market capitalization, the total value of all tokens in circulation, needs to be high enough to support that valuation. But when it comes to Shiba Inu, if it hits one penny, then its market cap will surpass the GDP of major countries worldwide, which seems unlikely. So the only option to reach that price point is through token burn. Burning tokens is one way to potentially decrease the token supply, and some cryptocurrency communities, including Shiba Inus, may discuss or consider token burning as a means to increase scarcity and, in turn, drive up the price per token. Token burning involves permanently removing a certain number of tokens from circulation, reducing the overall supply. However, Shiba Inu did not meet expectations, and the token burn was not large enough to surpass the one cent mark. And this is where things get interesting. They are launching a completely new burn mechanism, and it unfolds in two distinctive phases. Number one, manual phase, the phase we are currently in. Initially, the burn process will be meticulously overseen by the official deployer wallet. Think of the burn process like baking a cake. In the beginning, the chef, official deployer wallet, carefully watches and controls all the ingredients to make sure everything is just right. This manual burn phase, hands-on approach, allows for real-time monitoring and adjustments, ensuring a harmonious alignment with the network's overall health and sustainability. Imagine you're driving a car and you have a dashboard with all sorts of indicators. The hands-on approach here is like constantly checking the dashboard while driving to make sure the car is running smoothly. This helps maintain the car's health and ensures you reach your destination without any issues. This manual burn phase also involves implementing necessary changes in the network, a process carefully coordinated with other validators and node operators. Picture a team of architects working on a building. As they construct different parts, they need to communicate and coordinate to ensure the entire structure is sound. Similarly, in the crypto world, when they talk about implementing changes in the network, it's like adjusting different parts of the system so that everything works well together. So, in simpler terms, in the beginning, the process of burning tokens is closely monitored and controlled by a specific wallet to make sure it's done correctly. This hands-on approach helps in real-time adjustments to keep the entire crypto network healthy and sustainable. Additionally, making changes to the network involves careful coordination with other participants in the crypto community, similar to how different players work together on a construction project or in a team sport. The Shiba Inu team promised three Shiba Inu burns before moving to the next phase, which is called automated transition. And just today, we successfully completed the second burn. If you remember, the first one was not that long ago. It's been just two weeks. It was 8.2 billion Shiba tokens valued at over 70,000 US dollars. But anyway, now we are looking forward to the third token burn to be made, 
and this is where we will get to the next phase called automated transition. Beginning in January, the mechanism will undergo a transformative shift towards automation. This transition marks a significant upgrade phase, focusing on enhancing efficiency and reliability. The automated burn process is set to operate based on predefined rules, introducing a layer of predictability and transparency. This evolution aims to make the burning process not only more efficient, but also more transparent, laying the groundwork for a streamlined and automated mechanism. Imagine a restaurant where initially, the chef personally oversees every dish to make sure it's perfect. However, starting in January, the kitchen undergoes a transformation. They introduce advanced cooking equipment and automated systems. This upgrade is like moving from manual control to an automated system in crypto. In the new setup, the chef sets up specific rules for the cooking process, just like a recipe. The kitchen now operates based on these predefined rules without the chef having to watch every step. This shift is similar to how in crypto, they are transitioning towards automation in the burning process. So the automation upgrade is like upgrading the kitchen to make cooking more efficient and reliable. The automated process follows clear rules, making it predictable and transparent, much like following a recipe. The goal is to make the burning process not only more efficient, like cooking faster with modern equipment, but also transparent, like being able to see the ingredients and steps clearly. This move sets the stage for a smoother and automated system, just like a restaurant kitchen that operates seamlessly with advanced cooking technology. However, there is something that I have to make clear. If you watched my previous videos, you know that the second burn of Shiba Inu tokens was delayed and made people very angry. These hate messages towards Shiba Inu team members made one of them speak out. If I have information, I provide it. If I don't, I don't. As per my observation on the blockchain, things are progressing with the burns and will soon witness a substantial burn. The blockchain has its own mind, and most importantly, the market is a crucial part of dealing with assets. Shiba Magazine is new, and we will iron out everything over time. Oh my god, but there was a date. Yeah, I stayed awake the whole night too, but that's my own decision. However, it's not even important. The fact is, the dev's decision was more crucial than following up on a specific date. To do things properly, we need to be flexible. Just a few weeks ago, people were claiming it would take forever to burn 25k. Now they FUD because it's not an immediate $800,000 burn. Bridging from Shibarium takes seven days. It arrived. No worries. As Shitoshi said, this is why we don't give dates ever. I feel guilty. I did ask for an announcement to be made, and when it was done, it couldn't be followed up due to market conditions. Just another day in Shiba land. Thank you to all who understand the situation. I'm happy to see all that's happening around. If an investor truly believes in the long-term potential of Shiba Inu, it's essential to maintain a perspective of patience and understanding when facing delays and promises made by the team members. Expressing frustration or spreading fear, uncertainty, and doubt. In response to delays, doesn't contribute positively to the project's development. Investors should recognize that the cryptocurrency space, including projects like Shiba Inu, operates in a dynamic and often unpredictable environment. Unexpected challenges, market fluctuations, and technical complexities can lead to delays in planned milestones. However, it's crucial to distinguish between delays caused by genuine difficulties and those resulting from a lack of effort or commitment. Instead of succumbing to frustration, a more constructive approach is to support the team and project through challenges. Trust in the team's dedication to achieving their goals and delivering on promises, even if the timeline may be adjusted. Negative sentiment within the community can hinder the team's morale and may not contribute to resolving issues faster. Ultimately, a positive and patient outlook aligns with the long-term vision of Shiba Inu's success. Trust in the team's ability to navigate obstacles, adapt to changes, and work towards the project's growth. Constructive feedback and open communication can foster a healthier community environment, allowing for better collaboration between the team and investors. But what do you think of that? Comment down below. I'd be eager to read your opinion. If you are curious to find more, make sure to click one of the videos you see on the screen. And with that, we come to the end of this video. If you enjoyed the video, then please like this video and don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section. This really helps me with the YouTube algorithm. Also, please share this video to as many people as possible. Let's get this news out there.